Lashpreneurs here Walsh here with your Lash Biz Tip of the Day and today's tip is on a cancellation policy and you have to have one in your business if you plan on ever making consistent money. So I get that emergencies happen, I get that stuff comes up and my cancellation policy has gone through a lot of changes. It first started off very vague, just basically, please don't cancel on me. But after you start to get busy enough and you've had enough no-shows or cancellations, you get real crisp on that uh, cancellation policy. That thing should be a legally binding document as far as I'm concerned. Because we are an appointment-based business. You know, if our clients don't show up, we don't get paid. If you didn't show up to your work, if your client didn't show up to work, then they wouldn't get paid. So it's only fair that you have a very clear cancellation policy. You may feel like you're being too strict, but really it's out of protection of your own business. And somebody who's not going to honor that shouldn't be your client. So make sure your cancellation policy is airtight. Have a good one.